According to UNHCR data, more than 10 million people have been displaced from their homes due to the attack on Ukraine and have sought asylum in neighboring countries, mainly Poland. Despite not having borders with Ukraine, Turkey is among the countries that Ukrainian asylum seekers are reaching frequently. As per the Geneva Convention and the Law on Foreigners and International Protection, applicants who come to Turkey and apply for asylum are entitled to certain rights. The different types of statutes that Ukrainian asylum seekers could obtain and reach will be explained in this content that we have prepared. International Protection if states are unable to ensure their citizens' access to fundamental human rights and become incapable of taking the necessary measures due to various reasons, persons may have to request protection from another country. In this situation, persons who request asylum in another country are granted a status known as international protection. International protection ensures that individuals attain safety, are not sent back to places where their lives are in danger, access fundamental human rights. Refugee status and subsidiary protection status are included in the concept of international protection. Persons who come to Turkey and request asylum are first granted international protection applicant status. Then, the status of the applicants is decided upon following the interview conducted with them. Until the, their interview is finalized, persons requesting asylum reside in Turkey with an International Protection Applicant Identity Document. Their asylum requests, identity document procedures and interviews are addressed and performed by Provincial Directorates of Migration Management. International protection application is not subject to any kind of fee or cost. Fundamental rights of international protection applicants. International protection applicants, refugee status and subsidiary protection status holders are entitled to certain fundamental rights in Turkey. These rights are the right to education, the right to health, the right to access the labor market, the right to justice, social aids and service. International protection application does not substitute for a work permit. International protection applicants must wait for six months to work. In case they find a job after six months, employers may apply for a work permit on behalf of the international protection applicants. Obligations of international protection applicants International protection applicants have certain obligations they must abide by in Turkey. International protection applicants cannot travel outside the assigned province without obtaining a travel permit from the provincial directorates of migration management and must live within the borders of this province. International protection applicants may be obliged to leave their signature at provincial directorates of migration management at certain intervals. If these obligations are not compiled with, the international protection application will be considered to be withdrawn. Short-term residence permit Foreigners in Turkey of Ukrainian nationality may apply for a short-term residence permit if they do not want to request asylum. In order to apply for a short-term residence permit, the foreign person must have entered the country with a passport and must have applied within the visa period of 90 days following the day of entry. Applicants must fill out the necessary forms through the website eikamet.goch.go.tr and must be represented at the relevant provincial directorate of migration management on the date of appointment together with the requested documents in order to apply for a short-term residence permit. Foreigners residing in Turkey with a short-term residence permit are not holders of asylum seeker status and cannot benefit from the protection rights stipulated in the 1951 Geneva Convention. Short-term residence permit does not substitute for a work permit. 
A separate application must be made to the Provincial Directorates of Migration Management in order to obtain a work permit.